first, we have to make the base of the bat. Take a piece of wood about this size, and we're going to chisel it down so that it's round and flat, just like the real bat. So now we finished the base. Here's the base of that, the part that your hand's going to be on. Pretty good, right? So now we're going to make the grips. The grips are going to be made out of a piece of wood, very thin, very hard. So you're going to trace out, for me I'm just going to scrape a line. So you're going to trace a straight line across, like that. Now that will be your cutting line to cut across from. Looks like a bat to be. Alright, you need a long piece of molding now. This is going to make the part of the bat that hits the ball. So what you're going to do is you're going to lay it down, and you're going to take the handle and line it up just about where you want it to be. Make a line right there. Next, you bring it over to a saw and you're going to cut it. Now, now I am going to be gluing all the pieces together. So just use regular school glue, it'll work fine. So I'll be back in a second with the bat finished. Hey kids, you want some drugs? Well come to Uncle Bob's Drugstore! Now, what you gotta do, last step, everything's all glued together. I made another bat. All you gotta do is just take a hammer and give it a good whack. Pretty good. All right, here's your bat now. Pretty good. I burned some Louisville Slugger name into it. Uh, let's go see how it hits. All right, here we go. Home run. Oh, 